clearly Hua uh, HPG, a steel maker, is benefiting from the growth of the real estate market. Uh, over the last, uh, I would say, 12 to 24 months, um, the real estate market has been very strong in Vietnam. I think primarily because interest rates have been falling and a lot of folks, domestic folks, are looking for alternative assets to invest in. Um, the real estate uh, market has come up, as well as the stock market. As you can see, um, the value of the stocks have gone up, but also liquidity. Daily, uh, average daily trading have gone from $150, $200 million per day last uh, about a year ago to, to $800 million per day today. So it's gone up significantly. So the overall theme we're seeing is a lot of folks are like, taking money out of the bank because interest rates are falling, and they're looking for alternative channels, uh, one of which is real estate and the, the other of which is the, real, uh, the, the stock market. And this comes on the, be- the, the, the premises that it, it, is not, um, it is not legal for domestic folks to invest abroad. So they are pretty restricted in terms of the asset classes that they can invest today, which primarily revolves around domestic asset classes. As an investor, are you looking at the renewable energy space? Because when I talk to a lot of people, uh, Vietnam is really big on solar energy. Yes. uh, In the last couple of years, the government has uh, made a concerted effort to uh, promote uh, renewable energy, particularly in solar, uh, wind uh, as well. And uh, they they did so uh, by allowing uh, developers to enjoy a a, a higher tariff uh, for their investments. Um, as a result, we saw a significant increase in solar panels, uh, solar panel farms, and solar panels on top of factories and, and, and buildings. And so we're seeing a significant increase in that, which is, I think it's, it's, it's good. Um, the key here is, 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 uh, is that it's going to allow a lot of businesses to have alternatives to getting energy into their factories and their homes, whether it's from the government or it's from the solar panels.